Okay, so one of the uh, things that changed in 2016 was uh, the Tone King amp range, which was um, previously being made under the Premier Builders Guild kind of umbrella, has moved over to the boutique amp guys. So uh, they bought all the rights to the name and the design. So you're going to see some of the old favorites like the Falcon and the Imperials and the Sky Kings and the Majesty and stuff like that, including, which we'll show you in a second, the really, really cool uh, Iron Man attenuators uh, carrying on. But so the only new one that we found so far is the Gremlin, which is, uh, by the looks of things, a little uh, KT66 single-ended tube amplifier with a 12-inch speaker. Um, the two channels, the rhythm and the lead channel, volume and tone, and the attenuator built in as well. Uh, this, we think, will be around about the thousand pound mark. So it'll be the entry level kind of Tone King model. Anyway, Pete's gonna play a little bit. Um So you can see it's that classic low-powered Fender kind of tube amplifier uh, that crunches up nicely when you drive it. I mean, it's so freaking loud in here. Uh, I'm not even entirely sure whether that was gigging volume or not. Um, it's impossible to tell. Um, but I, obviously with the attenuator, you can dial it right back to be like a home use amp. Anyway, my favorite, uh, well, I say favorite, I like all the amps, but the product that I think Tone King do better than anybody else uh, are their attenuators. So let's go and have a look at those. Currently in the, in the range, the Iron Man Mini is the only one available, which I think is the one that works up to about 30 watts. Uh, but the cool news is that the original gigantic Iron Man has been redone into the Iron Man 2. So these will take your louder amplifiers. Um, to be honest with you, I don't really know what the difference between the two here is. If it's just as simple as a different color, I'm not really sure. Maybe or they maybe different. They'll take different powers. But um, if you have a loud amplifier, loud valve amplifier, oh my god, uh, a loud valve amplifier that you need to tame. Uh, this is, in my opinion, probably the best way to do it. Wow. Oh, okay. I don't know if you heard that on the mic, but Pete said he thinks this one is the 50 watt one. They are so heavy! Ah! Is that the 50 watt one? Well, 120 as well. Oh, so maybe it's just a color thing, I don't know. But we'll get these into the store and we'll do some demos soon. But that's it for Tone King at NAM 2017. Boom.